Thousands of dead fish are washing up on Oahu shores, and the calls are starting to pour in. It's a problem that we first flagged last week when reports began coming in from Waikiki. KITV 4's Catherine Cruz has the latest, all new at 6. The sight of hundreds of dead fish along the shoreline of Nanakuli Beach Park and out to Maili made more than a few people worried. Very concerned, you know, because it, it, it's an unusual type of occurrence, and we don't know if it's, uh, if it's environmental or if it's caused by man. Yaya said he got even more worried when he heard that his friend saw them washing up at Ka'ava this weekend, too. When I shared the picture with him this morning, he, would, he was expressing some concerns, too, like, wow, what's going on? State biologists began collecting samples near Ko'olina and along the south shore when the reports began coming in on July 1st. Test results won't be known for a few weeks, but they believe the dead fish are what some people know as flying gunnards. There are different species from the malolo or regular flying fish. The gunnards have long fins, but they glide underwater and don't actually fly above the surface. Biologists suspect the fish kill may be related to a spawning cycle around this time of the summer rather than something toxic in the water. If there was a, a chemical spill of some kind, then you'd see many species dying off. But the mass die off is a bit of a mystery. We don't know what specifically has caused this particular die off. Uh, we have seen uh, these kinds of die-offs before, and so it's not an unusual thing. It's not common, uh, but we have seen single-species die-offs before. The public is being asked to report any sightings of dead fish to the eyes of the reef network, which in turn is alerting the state. We're keeping track of all the reports coming in and, and trying our best to respond to them, um, especially to try to get fresh samples. So we definitely appreciate the help. Now, it might not be a good idea to handle the dead fish on the beach. They are small fish, only a few inches long, but they do have a barb, so you could get pricked. Now, once the test results are in, they will be posted at the Reef Response website at the Department of Land and Natural Resources. But if you see any of those dead fish in any other area, do report it. As for cleanup, well, I think a lot of people are hoping Mother Nature takes care of the job. Back to you, Bianchi. Paula.